This machine has a lot of improvements that essentially improve the safety and accuracy of treatment, one of which has better image guidance. So that's the idea that we can take an accurate picture of the target prior to treatment. Now with this technology, we can get a CT scan, which provides a 3D representation of both the target and the tissues around it. So we can verify that before the beam goes on, that we're not only hitting the target, but also avoiding critical organs nearby. Some other improvements on this machine, there's what's called Vision RT, which essentially a program that creates a 3D representation of the outside body contour or shape. If the patient moves, the beam shuts off, so that just helps with the safety and accuracy of the treatment. Being able to offer these technologies here, beneficial for people in the community because Essentially, radiation is a daily treatment. You know, we offer treatment Monday through Friday, similar to other facilities, but you have to drive to treatment. And if you have to drive to a faraway place, that's, you know, hours out of your day. And if you can provide that same type of treatment closer to home, uh, it's much more convenient for patients. Also being able to provide SBRT uh, for patients can also reduce the number of treatments that they have to undergo. So for example, like prostate cancer, um, historically they would treat in anywhere from 39 to 44. Uh, and in select patients, those with you know, intermediate risk or low risk prostate cancer, you can offer SBRT to the prostate, which can be done in five treatments typically. So I'm excited about the new technologies that we're able to offer here. I think it will expand the, the type of treatments that we can offer patients. It'll improve the convenience for patients in terms of the number of times they have to travel. Um, and I think the safety and accuracy of treatment is improved. So uh, I think it will benefit a lot of patients that uh, are undergoing treatment for cancer with radiation here.